as given in the question let us draw the isometric view of a cylinder of base diameter 50 mm and height 60 mm let us draw the orthographic view first the top view will be a cylinder of base diameter 50 mm so measure 25 mm radius and draw a circle to form the top view then draw the xy line over that draw the front view the solid is having a height of 60 mm so the front view will be a rectangle of 60 mm height now let us start the isometric view draw a horizontal line then draw a vertical line then draw a 30 degree line towards the right side then draw a 30 degree line towards the left hand side now we can start drawing the projection let us measure the front width of that solid that is 50 mm similarly the side width is also 50 mm so let us draw a square of 15 into 50 here that will be acting as a base so here i have to draw 50 mm front width the side which is also 50 mm now draw a line parallel to this right hand side 30 degree line now draw another line to the parallel to the left hand side 30 degree line now it will meet the common point at the center now what we have to do is mark the center point of this line of this 50 mm line that is 25 mm similarly mark that in all the sides i am marking 25 mm here then here and here also now draw a line from this top point and this midpoint like this similarly draw from this bottom point to this midpoint okay then take your compass and now we have four centers they are these two points and these two points actually the isometric view of a circle will be an ellipse and uh, there is a method to draw this ellipse that method is called four center method let us see how the four center methods method works this is the first center from this point having this point as your radius draw an arc here now by having this point as radius this point as center and this point as radius draw an arc here similarly having this point as center and this point as radius drawing an arc here now we have got the base side of the cylinder then draw the same type of parallelogram in the top side the height of the solid is 60 mm so take 60 mm height and draw a point here similarly from this point draw a point on 60 mm height and from this point draw a 60 mm point similarly from the last base point now if we connect all these points we will get a parallelogram In this side also we have to use the four center method. For that we have to mark 
the center point of all these both lines here i am marking center 25 mm here also i am marking a point at 25 mm and here and here so now i have now i have marked four points and now we have to draw the lines from this top point to this center point the top point to the right hand side center point the bottom point to the right hand side center point the bottom point to the left hand side center point now we have four centers what are they this is one center this is one center this is one center and this is one center by using these four centers we have to draw the ellipse here using this point as center and this point as radius we have to draw an arc then using this point as center and this point as radius we have to more draw an arc here similarly having this point as center and this point as radius mark an arc here then having this point as center this point as radius mark an arc here now we have got a cylinder if we connect these points so this is how we have to draw the cylinder in isometric view thank you